Hello guys, welcome to a vlog and welcome to a very exciting day because today uh, I am taking my ex racehorse Ember to a hunter trial. Hooray! Yay! And I'm bringing Justine, my trainer slash friend, <laughs> along for the journey um, because now she's got nothing else better to do on her Sundays now Absolutely. that the bloodhounding season Sunday has finished. I thought she could come with me. But I wanted to start this vlog by saying a huge thank you to the sponsors. Ooh, the sponsors of this video, HelloFresh. They are a fantastic meal kit subscription service and they have saved my bacon. <laughs> many, many times. Says the vegetarian. Says the vegetarian. <laughs> HelloFresh is a meal kit subscription service. So you get fresh, meals, easy for you to prepare, delivered to your door. So it will arrive in a fantastic box like this. You will find the recipes that you have ordered. You will select from a huge variety of different menus. They do change weekly, so there's always a great selection and you can order vegetarian, pescatarian, if you're calorie smart, the under 30 minute ones, they are so, so easy. The fresh ingredients will come in a little bag like this. You will receive a recipe card. Now guys, this is the, this is the easiest thing about HelloFresh is all of the meals will have their own designated recipe cards with step-by-step, -step, easy to follow instructions on the back. You may know that I am a vegetarian, but I decided to do the chicken one today because Rob has been so super and so supportive to me over the season. And he's also helped massively with the bloodhounds and um, been running for them. So I thought what better way to treat him after a hard day than a lovely tandoori chicken tray bake, which is marinating. Look at that chicken. I'm giving you guys the chance to get 60% off your first box, which is a massive saving, and then 20% off your next boxes for the next two months. This, I have been told, is also valid in Ireland too, so don't miss out. There will be a QR code somewhere on this screen. Now, this offer is available for new customers and returning customers that cancelled their subscription over 12 months ago. But we are obviously going to do a taste test quickly before we kick off with today's vlog. So I will hurry up and get cooking. Luckily, this recipe is one which takes between 30 and 35 minutes. So, so quick and easy. So I have served Rob his supper. So we'll let him eat in peace. So enjoy my darling. I'm sure it's going to get the Finest seal of approval because it was made might be by me and HelloFresh. So guys, don't miss out on the offer. Again, I'll put all the details below. Right, so I'm starting this vlog at Justine's because that is where Ember currently is. So I dropped off Ember on Thursday, Thursday uh, because I was going to a wedding. Um, and Justine kindly said that she would look after him uh, whilst I was away, which you did. Justine then called me on Saturday yeah. and said, um, Lucy, I have an idea. I've got a plan. She's got a plan. And uh, let her run it past me. So she called me back about 10 minutes later. And um, I feel like we need a pre-intro to the plan though. Yeah. So, okay. Last event, you may know that Ember was a bit he was fantastic, but he was a bit tricky cross country and really struggling with the rhythm. <laughs> oh, let's rewind a bit because on Tuesday, yes, I came to yours and um, we went up the gallop. We went the up fences. the gallop, and I have some fantastic GoPro footage to show you right now, which will explain it but basically the long and short of it was we needed to get that forward canter without him surging surging and tiddling off and making it difficult now he's got a very high head carriage which is kind of off-putting because it makes you want to pull him but you you can't really it's a it's very tricky so anyway take a watch of this gopro footage it's not perfect but it's definitely a work in progress but we've come to justine's and um you may know that he had his last event. 
he was a bit unruly in the in the cross country phase and he kind of took the mic a little bit with me um, in the sense that he he wasn't napping which was good but now we have the opposite problem where he's uh, basically bolting at the fences I have to say turning back on ourselves is probably not the most sensible idea no but she says I need to be firm with him you know and not just come back to me hey come on that's it well done good lad that's it and that is a better canter come on I don't want to overthink it now Come on, get on. Come on. I'm not looking down, I'm looking up. Come on, come on, come on. Good boy. That's it. That's it. That's it, good boy. Come on. more forward a bit more forward but not like that good boy oh he's such a twat boy that's it that's it okay seen it seen it seen it come on good boy now help oh oh good boy Seen it, seen it, seen it, seen it. Come on, boy, good boy. Good boy, seen it, seen it, seen it. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Wee, good lad. That's it, and hole, and hole. That's it, good boy. And away. Good boy. Good boy. If there was a flag on that fence, he would have taken it out, but still landing and we're not, it's struggling to go up a gear without it getting wild. So obviously with cross country, you need to keep it in a forward rhythm like the whole time um, but where I'm getting all the time faults is having to pull him up having to get him back to me it's quite a big jump that ember good boy that's quite big that's it right. good boy that's it here we go that's it, good boy. That's fine. That's fine. Good boy. Oh my god. That's just a tick. Good boy. Good boy, head down, head down. Good lad. That's it. Good boy. 
Yeah. You're then bringing him back to that collected show jumping cap. Okay. You, you've got, got to stop keep gradually letting it. Letting it go a bit. Okay. You actually stayed straight into yeah. the like that. Yeah, yeah. If you bring him back too much, that's what yeah. you do. Yeah, okay. I, th I think that was. <laughs> I just had to kind of trust it for the last one. Yeah, but yes, okay. <laughs> you saw a, a bit of a fly. That was a. <laughs> lovely. You know, it jumped it nicely. Yeah. Yeah. Right, fast forward to Saturday when the plan was coming together. I, I knew that we needed to get Lucy in a position where she could ride at like a normal cross country pace. Um, but Ember makes that incredibly difficult. And Ember's got to learn to relax and not, he's not a racehorse anymore. He doesn't have to go flat out. Um, bearing in mind he was a sprinter. So he's got to learn to just relax and, and learn to lob along, but so that you can then press him on without him surging yeah, forward and yeah. adjust and he's just got to relax now um charlie my husband is was an ex-jockey uh point to point jockey rode around the fox hunters which are the national fences he's and he was he is very 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 good at settling strong courses so my plan was to ask charlie if he would just come to him and just see what he thought and whether we could try a different approach um, which Charlie did, can I ramble on for that? Yeah, you? of course. Charlie did, Please, uh, my horse out. bullet that I took round Burley was incredibly strong when I first had him and I struggled to do any canter work with him. And um, anyway, Charlie cantered him for me for a couple of weeks and really helped him to settle. So I knew he could do it. And Ember is very, very much like bullet. Um, and uh, so I asked Charlie if he would do that. I then asked Lucy if she was happy for Ember to stay for a week and for us to give it a go and so on saturday we charlie took him up round uh, my fields and up the gallop and it was okay it was he didn't go too badly and then i explained to charlie what i wanted in a bit more detail and he then really started to crack it and it was it, it, he went well i sent you a video didn't i and he yeah. looked he looked better it, it, it was coming yeah and i just said to lucy um could could he maybe stay for a week and let's see if we can really get Charlie to crack it um, and get him to settle down um, and relax into more of a, a more natural, even rhythm. <laughs> so that's what we did. So, well, and, well, that's the plan. Well, that is the plan, and I mean, I felt that up the gallop a little we bit. We were already more. We were there, kind of there yeah. a little bit. But today was going to be, today is going to be a real test to see if we can achieve that. Put it into practice in part, but I'm not expecting it to be a miracle cure because you know, often when you go to a competition, you go back a stage. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, let's see. We'll see. We'll see. So. Should we should we get a move on? Yeah, let's okay. go. All right, see ya. It was a beautifully windy, sunny day at Horse Heath. I was gonna say horse trials, but it's not horse trials, is it? It's not, it's a pony club event. It's a pony club event, guys! Today I'm doing pony club! Yay! <laughs> anyway, we're looking around and there's lots of little probably under ten children here, so um, it's gonna be great when I'm there's an old lady! Found one. <laughs> That's fine. She looks older than me. She anyway. looks 12. No, she does. She looks old. Um, anyway, so we've got her. Well, can it's... you do a close up and she'll love it when she sees no. herself on your video? <laughs> <laughs> we've got her and we're going to walk the course. So today okay. I'm doing the open 80, which means hopefully I won't be with all of the children. Not that there's anything wrong with the children. No, it's there's nothing wrong with children. When you it's line just... up with the prize giving and you're beaten by a five-year-old, a six-year-old, an eight-year-old and a twelve-year-old, that would be a tad embarrassing. <laughs> Thank you for your, all your confidence. Can you, um, can you put pigtails in? 
No, what's it? Right, let's go. Let's go. Walk We've also got Willabine here today as my lorry dog. Fig and Lulu didn't get the call up because Will is just so good and so so happy to chill. You can't bring a whip it out in the wind. No, I just know. shiver. She doesn't like it. Right, let's go. Him up for me. Quite all right. Looking good, Ember. You feeling ready? Looking pretty Absolutely chilled. Absolutely feeling ready. Yeah. Did some good cantering yesterday, so I hope you're a bit, a bit more tired. Hey. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if they're a bit short. They don't look it. I put them down to what looked like your hole. They okay. definitely don't look short. Amber's looking very chilled. Nice and relaxed? Yep. Good boy. To say, and I'm very proud, Molly, of the horse, obviously. Look how chilled he looks. That's looking good. Can my syrups go up a bit? What? Definitely all the pain this video. Hey. Video. Oh, of course she can be in Lucy's video. <laughs> well, then she posts on YouTube. Yeah, I think so. Well, maybe. All right, I'll interview you. Okay, so I'm videoing Lucy, and here we have. Hi, I'm one of Lucy, um, one of Lucy's followers. Excellent. So, wish her. Are you going to wish her? Yeah, the best I'm going to wish her the best of luck. Good luck, Lucy. Excellent. And good luck, Ember. Excellent. Well done. Thank you. Just don't alter anything, I but don't even sit down if you don't have to. No. Just keep coming in that rhythm. Yeah. Because then you're not having to rely on the bit. 
You know, if he's like that, he might not be like that out there. But that was that was perfect. I don't. He I didn't don't. rush. He waited for the yeah. fence, and you were cantering off his back. Yeah. Little little shout out to Charlie. Little shout out to Charlie Ward. <laughs> Extraordinary jockey. Matt's already so I'm so He did a really good job. He feels great. So. Oh, that was good, um, that. That was really good. Yeah. You yeah. did a good job there. That was perfect. Oh, that's Lucy, I think. She's warmed up. She's about to go soon. He warmed up really well, very chilled, and Lucy rode him brilliantly. So I hope this goes well. And we have gone to the crepery, Mel's Magical Crepes, and uh, I've gone for a cheese and chutney one. Oh, she's really nice. They're, they're mine's cheese and ham. Mm. Mm. Um, this is the first event that I've gone to for ages that prints photos on the day. That yeah. doesn't exist anymore, does it? Since COVID, anyway. <coughs> so we're, we're like two naughty schoolgirls sat on the fences around the back around the back of the freaking food lorry um so yeah and then i'll probably we'll probably make a move and i'll let you have your sunday back <laughs> i'm always eating when you film me <laughs> always <laughs> flapjack i've got the goods we're gonna i pick the biggest one so we can share it <laughs> Have a nice roll. Good boy. They're nice. You've had a wee and a roll. Yes. And now we have some nice village. Oh, you lucky boy. Lucky boy, D. Tucking into his well earned red mills. Okay. We've also got some foreign equine supplements in there. Electrolytes, even. Um, just to replenish possibly some of that sweaty salt that you've lost, hey? Yes? 
Good boy. Woo! We are back and everything's done and I'm very happy to be putting the kettle on right now. Don't show them on Messi's kitchen. No, that's why I'm showing it this way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at the beautiful flowers behind and everything. Um, so, well, I'll wait for you to finish filling up the tap. Right. It's very antisocial. Hello, doggies. Yeah. Oh, bubble, bubble, bubble. Um, oh, I think that was a success. What do you think? I, I think it was a great success. I think what was amazing. Great success. What was amazing was <laughs> when you got on him. When you got on him. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Hang on. I'll have to wait for a coffee then. Yeah. When you got on him in the practice room, he looked really chilled. And you started to canter and straight away, he was in a better outline. Yeah. He was relaxed. He was hopefully you'll be able to see my uh, rubbish footage that I videoed. Um, and he was relaxed and he was he was he didn't have his head up in the air. And you were able to come round in a, a quite a relaxed contact and just pop over the fence. Nothing altered. You didn't sit down. You didn't have to pull. He didn't surge. You just kept coming. And it yeah. was. It was actually exactly what I hoped we'd have by the end of the week, but mm. we got it, you know, you got it straight away and you rode him brilliantly. Um, yeah, and then he set off and he got a bit excited at the start, didn't he? He was a bit, he was a bit... Reverted a little bit again. Which, into the you know, paddling. The paddling and his head up a bit. But then you went through the woods, you came out of the woods and it just got better and better. It did. And yeah. I felt very happy. I still don't know what the results are. <laughs> But he went really yeah. well. So um, my next event is a training event, which is a combined training, essentially. It's like cross show jumping and then cross country, a little oh, down. No and dressage. Then. No dressage. Okay. I, it's not ideal, but. No, no, it's, it's yeah. Um, and then, so, but you can pick what size fences. So, oh, it, that's good. but we'll see how he goes. So he's going to stay here. He's going to have a day off tomorrow. He probably needs one. Yeah. And then he'll do some more counter work with the. The super the jockey chair. in question. But you, you do know what Charlie says, that it, rather than you pay him, you've got to get on the tractor. Yeah, well, I think he'll probably probably regret saying that. I've done all these wiggly drilling lines. Is that what you're doing at the moment, drilling? I think so. Oh, yeah. wow, look at yeah. my knowledge. Yeah. Um, anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the vlog, I really hope you did, then uh, let me know. And um, stay tuned for more fun times and adventures ahead. And you can also follow Justine because she's out eventing and um, she's smashed. Have you put your last vlog out? Yeah. From Friday. From Friday. No. no <laughs> okay, well, there'll be a vlog on Justine's channel at uh, Norton Disney 100, which I was supposed to do, but didn't. Um, but we've had way more fun today. We well, have. Yeah. And. Uh, yeah, put the kettle on there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put the kettle on there. Right, okay. See you guys. Ciao. Bye. 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 Bye.